Who won the two tadpole treble steam keys? Demartini's Meek Kale! De Demartini's Michael! Do I not get a second go? Fupo! Get on with it! Fed Headphone! Congratulations! If you did not win, please don't kill me. The game's on sale right now, I think, anyway. You should still buy it. On with the show! Hey, bits and bites! This is Kakujo. Welcome back to Tadpole Treble. When we last left off, we discovered B Blump a Dump over here. He takes challenge flies and bubbles. He's found himself a nice little niche, a nice little way to enjoy all of life's pleasures without doing any of the work! He's even covered in syrup! So welcome to the Barracuda Caverns. I'm not like hey! Dang it. I've learned that one of the ways you really gotta like master this game is you've got to master that. You've gotta master when to just hold down the button. I guess it's supposed to, I don't know, mimic some kind of Ah! Not real barracudas! They didn't tell me there'd be real barracudas! Oh, you gotta master just holding it down like a piano slide or something, you know? It's stressful though, you never know if you're gonna do it right. Alright, getting there. Yeah, and I haven't even practiced that much with this game, so you know. I'd like to say there's a- oh man. That guy looks hungry. Or at least dangerous. He's been in a knife fight, which immediately means that they're a ne'er-do-well. I feel bad for people with scars who just, you know, fell down some stairs or something. I mean, I'm sure when they want to, they can cash in on that and get some cool guy points, but like mostly you don't get looked at by people or their their mothers. They warn you about people. I got a scar here. You probably can't see it now, though. It was, you know where, when I, where I got it? It was in a knife fight. With a rock that I fell down on top of when I was four years old. Yeah, I keep forgetting that those are actually like slappy poles. I guess you see mushrooms and you assume they just want to be left alone. Was that gold nugget wanting to do some stuff? Yeah, see, that's why I keep getting, uh, I was getting a really bad score on the the guy serenading me level because I wasn't hitting the mushrooms. Sorry if I thought that would be sending the wrong signals. Oh yeah, also, okay, and when you get treble charge, you can hold down A, and then it lets you run into the black things, and you get, oh my god, one extra point! Which is, which is cool, I guess. Uh, I can't handle that. I can't, I can't handle that. That's like, oh my god, I can't handle that! No! Ever since Banjo-Kazooie with their- Oh! Naru and a- <laughs> That scared me so much, I hate a little- Stuff coming out of dark holes. If stuff just comes out right, you'd think that that wouldn't be a big deal, considering usually my horror pet peeve, or the thing that usually gets me is, no! When things like peer slowly around corners, you know? But also things just coming out right is, it's pretty- not respectable. Oh, you didn't like that? Oh, you didn't like that! You don't like loud noises! I don't like spiky things, but they're everywhere and I've learned to adapt to life. Or mostly when I get hit, now I accept it. I'm never gonna get a good streak. Yeah, see, there you go. You just gotta hold down that there button. So you can slap the gold things? Man, if you wanna be slapped, you gotta be a ring. You know, that that's, that's how I roll. That's how tadpoles do. I feel really bad for this guy now. I feel like I'm not letting him sneeze. You can sneeze, just don't eat me, right? Whew. Sometimes it's kind of hard to tell exactly on what line these things are. Slap him! Oh, this is why you're trying to keep me out. Huh. Okay, cool. Oh god, the world's moving again. What do you mean C rank? I thought I'd, I have improved. Man, the game's difficulty ramps up. Snowfall Lake! What could possibly go wrong here? I'm only a- Ah, I got slapped in my dumb freaking fish. Can I restart? Sorry. No, I know we're trying to do a show here, but like, that was going to nag at me the entire rest of the- ah! Yeah, got it. The entire rest of this episode. Now I got everything so far! The perfect 100% streak! So I'm just maintaining this happiness. I'm considering just saying, forget this. Forget this Let's Play, I'm gonna get 100% for once. Oh, I'm sorry. Have I mastered this all of a sudden? Probably not. Woo! Yeah, there you go. First rule of cocky, Joe. Never get cocky. NEVER GET COCKY! My treble charge didn't even fire off in time because it takes forever. How you gonna get health and then also get slapped? Did you see that? The game actually like flipped out and couldn't tell where I was. Oh, that's not good. I ain't okay with the- 
you can't grab the magical bits and get hit by the black thing at the same time because it's one or the other. They're in separate lanes. It's fine. I got my health. I got my Bing. The worst search engine ever. I mean, I know it's popular to hate Bing, but have you ever actually tried to use it? Because Tenorio got herself a Windows phone recently because one of their smartphones was super cheap. And let's just say that Bing, I don't think it can be called a search engine. Am I poisoned? Was I straight up poisoned? Or was it? were they just about to be like, yo, you're about to die? You know, sometimes you gotta leave balls behind. And if you don't leave balls for the last, for the person behind you, how are they ever gonna become interested in balls? You know? That sounded not as bad in my head, but... Ooh. Because on one hand, you want to get everything, right? But then what if you have like a sibling, or just in general, you want to leave something behind? Thank God for video games though, right? I'm sure this happened. This right here, IRL, happened at one point. But only once! Because that's how it goes. Only one person gets to do it, and then it's all gone. <sighs> so I hope this tadpole had fun while they were able to. I'm considering activating my... Yeah, now you can't hurt me! Death to sea urchins! Was I getting hit by other stuff? Jeez. I think my uh, treble chart is only filled up by the, the actual monies. Thank goodness. Yeah, if, if whenever I exit the treble charge, it doesn't make the same flashing thing it does when I get hurt, that'd be great! A B, right? Oh no! Oh no! Gus, Gusty Rapids? I gotta tell you, that sounds like a 1960s stripper. But I'll try it. Oh hey! This doesn't have anything to do with that. Oh, there's a pole. You just had a great time, didn't you, buddy? No, wait, what? Wait a second! We're going backwards! Try that again! Wow! That completely evaded my my attention. I thought we were just like going through the entire level. They're gonna show me what's in the entire level before we came ba uh, came back around. Also, I was enamored with this duck. You and your habits almost destroyed me. This is good though. This is a nice little remedy for you know after a while when you ow you can't see properly anymore and everything's going this direction. So might as well make it go that direction. It's like it's like the logic. It's good logic. I can see where they came. I can see, I can see where they reached that conclusion. But it's like kid logic too. Like, oh, I, sp I spun too much, now I'm going to spin the other direction to fix my equilibrium, and then you just throw up. Holy crap, going backward is really hard, did you know? This just isn't right. It's not right! Are you expecting something to fly up your butt? Because, you know, there are more direct ways to do this. Oh, those things grow on plants. Man, those symbols, you think they grow on trees? Well, apparently they do. Also, I got a gem. Not quantifiable by tadpole means, but I'm sure it's shiny. Nope, I do not want to get drunk today. Drank up by a badger. Tadpoles can drink if they want to, you know? I won't judge. If you can handle it, and if it matches your lifestyle. CRAP! I didn't get a gem. This is what happens when you get drunk. <laughs> he licked me! Nasty boy. Okay, so I got, I got another gem. So they're just, they're just disappearing though, which makes me think these badgers are actually running a chain of popsicles. Gem-shaped popsicles. Small tiny reeds. Beats rock. I told those kids on the playground! How could that have possibly hurt me? Oh, am I supposed to be hitting you? Uh-oh. The game's falling into that, that one thing I don't like, where it's all like, the, the conveyance is a bit lacking here. This entire level so far has been just just giant mind biz. I mean, you know, Matthew Taranto would take a lot of his eh, inspiration from Nintendo, right? I mean, they did brawl in the family, so maybe he's totally fine with the uh, trial and error method of gameplay. Which is fine if you have all the time in the world. Me? I got a pie in the oven. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, that's all I can say, sorry. See, it's either say words, or at least hit the reeds. Ah, oh, man, I'm finally starting to acclimate to this. This is this is good, okay. I'm finally getting used to going right to left. It's not the same as reading right to left. Get the crap out of here. I'm a small child. That's fine, probably. A D? Well, you know what they say, 
a D is just a it's just a backwards bow and arrow. <laughs> I got an E2 award. Well, I didn't press anything. I didn't. By the way, all buttons on here are confirmed on the controller, so, uh. Prepare yourselves for that. Hey, this is actually the next level, though. Oh my god, what a palette cleanser that last level was! What a palette cleanser that last level was. I've never been so happy to go back to left to right, to the, to the default game style. It is truly a refresher. Because I can feel myself totally wanting to do this. D no! No piranhas. Okay? Can we not- <laughs> Piranhas horrify me. What is this called? Piranha Lun Jungle? Oh. Well, I mean, I should have read the brochure. You should have read the brochure! I'm starting to understand this now. The streak is 30. And that's how many points I'm getting from passing each of the, the spiky bits that I can't touch, yeah? So whenever I get hurt, that streak runs back down again and I get less points. So, it makes sense how this works. Are you okay, buddy? I Something that was inside of a bubble... I can't interact with it... Because I'm a tadpole! Ooh, what did I say about conveyance? Yeah, nice, yeah, real, real, real tricky. What are, you, what are you looking for exactly? A lozenge? What is that? What was that even? Probably stop eating it though, yeah? Look at your face! That can't be good for you, man. Oh. Oh, so we're... Are you guys hustling me? Are you greasing down the alleyway, snapping your little fingers? Are you about to sing me a song about how I shouldn't have come here or something? Because I, I, I'm trying to leave. You're not really making it easy for me to leave the, in the other direction, so we're just going right for now. Just don't touch the spiky things. That is ridiculous. This is supposed to be like a jungle, right? What is that thing? Oh, God! Oh, they're hustling me. Oh, they're giving me shoulder rubs, and I don't want it. Great. So yeah, there went my like amazing streak that was gonna give me an A. If I don't get an A before we leave today, I'm gonna be... Oh, of course, you reach downward and grab. Yeah, not uh, not upward, uh, downward. As one expects something exactly like this to do, that of course goes downward. That is so frustrating, come on. I feel like, it, I like the kind of game design where you're able to get something right the first time if you're able to keep up with it. But trial and error like that oops I didn't know kind of stuff, it just is a pet peeve of mine. Don't get me wrong, I enjoy the game just like, and I'm sure when I come back and I play this a second time, I'll be like, oh, I don't know what I was so upset about. You know, sometimes you just gotta, oh, flip off you weenie! Stop playing pool with your friends, no wonder some of you guys are getting sick. You guys are wasting your time. You should be taking your friend to the infirmary. Or whatever piranhas have. Okay, thank you. For once, someone else had to suffer trial and error. See, that was good conveyance. They took a bad guy, they sacrificed the bad guy first, into the piranha mouth and... Sweet. Sweet Caroline. The I'm sure there are more logical ways to grab yourself some food. Uh, it's in oh. Well, yeah, he was gonna fall down from above. No, I'm sorry. That that wasn't even that wasn't even the game's fault. I shouldn't be upset. That's what piranhas do. They jump in the air. They do they do a little spin, and then they fall down on top of their prey. It's fabulous. It's like a Broadway show except for free. I mean, you got to pay for the tickets to the jungle and whatnot, but it's a, it's a show. Yeah, you guys can eat that. Oh, was that not bees? I thought that was bees. I th I thought I was finally gonna get some freaking revenge over here. Here, one for you! Get out! Oh, yeah. The extra one for, you know, whoever wants to. Why would a prawn eat that? It's a gourd of some kind, yeah? Unless if that's, I mean, it's the jungle, you just never know. It could be a sack where people keep their blood. A C rank. Well, for trial and error's sake, I'm impressed that I even got that. Everyone, thanks for watching. I shall be looking forward to smashing these ranks into A's later. But that's all for now for us. Thanks for watching! Please leave a like and share this video with- holy crap, hold on. Oh man, everything's going to the right. And it's so strong. Is this what Mario feels like all the time? Is this what compels him to do the things he do? Because I can feel that I have this in- I have this strong urge to like go this way and just keep running. To match up with my- with my freaking what- what you call vertigo. Please leave a like and share this video with dizzy people. And until next video, see you then. How long are they going to keep making them spit in each other's mouths? I mean, graphics can only get better and more detailed. <laughs>